games love sprays. They're in pretty much everything. If you look at Tony Hawk's, you've got wall plants. If you look at Overwatch, you've got sprays on walls. Team Fortress, you've got sprays on walls. It's just everywhere. The thing is, slapping a texture on a surface, it seems simple, but it really isn't. There are a ton of annoying problems. Let's just try taking a flat image and let's put it on a wall. Damn you to hell, Newton, it's floating. Fine, okay. I'm gonna clip that image to the mesh so that it won't go off the edge. The corner, I can't put it on two meshes at once. That's gonna be a nightmare. And I can't even put a flat image on this damn amorphous blob. Okay then, so how do you get sprays to work on surfaces? Don't ask me, I just came here to watch Wii Sports speedruns with my projector on this amorphous blob. Da -da 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 All right, let's get there we go. Is this, did we solve sprays? Yeah, so it seems projecting an image onto a surface is the way to do it. But the way you actually do that in code is really complicated. You need fiddly shader code that's going to interlace a 2D image into a 3D world and project it along an x-axis, a y-axis, a z-axis, it's a nightmare. The ideal way to solve a problem like this is let someone do it for you. That's what I do. If you go to Godot Engine 4, they've added decal nodes and they just do the trick. They just project the image onto a surface. You can use it for bullet holes, you can use it for stickers, you can use it for posters, you can use it for sprays. Anything you want, you just get it on the surface, it's lovely. So if we can make our projection, how do we then get our spray paint into our game world? Well, we do have to do a few steps ourselves. First of all, we need to draw a line from our face to the wall we're looking at, and then we need to find out if that line is hitting the wall we're looking at. If it is hitting the wall, we then need to check, are you currently pushing the, uh, the, uh, the, spray, the spray paint button? If you are pushing the spray the spray paint button, now we can make our decal. We just need to spawn the decal, put it in the world, and put it where we're touching the wall with our view beam. Lastly, this decal, it projects downwards, so we kind of need to tilt our projector so it's facing what we're looking at. So if we point our projection in that direction, it'll be shining at the wall. Now this does get fiddly in corners, but it works in three dimensions, so it will still get a skewed image even on those edges. And then, bon appetit. Want the source code or a guide to Godot 4? Go and check out itch.io, I'm working on Godot for beginners, a thing to teach you how to use Godot 4 if you're coming from Godot 3. Thanks for watching, see ya!